Well, good morning, everyone. It's Wednesday morning. It's just after 11 a.m. Um, and this video is um, highlighting our adventures to Zapote on Monday. When we rode the e-bike from Bullihan to Zapote. I didn't film the trip there because I thought it was going to rain when we were leaving here and my phone doesn't have a waterproof case to put it in so I didn't want to hang it off the front of the bike. Um, the traffic was not bad, we had a good trip there. Um, after this brief introduction you'll see the photo of the, um, the dials on the e-bike. We used 15% of the battery at 25 kilometres. I was in second speed most of the way, nearly all the way actually. It's a little bit too much traffic to be in third speed, but second speed seems to be the best. It's it's frugal. It just you know sips at the juice. Um, number one speed is too slow. It's only like 20 miles, 20 kilometers an hour. And it's a little bit slow. You want to keep up at least with the flow of the traffic, and they seem to be averaging 25 to 30, and that's about what second speed will do. I think it'll do 35 top. Third speed will take you up to 50 kilometers. Anyway, we had a, a fairly uneventful journey, except for one occasion where I got sort of jammed between a jeepney and a, a car, and neither were going to yield. Everybody was merging from three lanes to one. It was near the construction zone, I think. And my front we, front tire rubbed the back tire of the, the car. That was it. <laughs> Apart from that, everything went well. Uh, but this, we went to Zapote to check on the build. Um, they were putting in the formwork for the floor, the first floor, and the steelwork. And it was to be inspected yesterday on Tuesday. And you'll see from the photos and the short video that Ray sent through that I tacked on to this video. He sent them through this morning that they were starting to pull. So obviously it passed the inspection. So enjoy the video. And I, I did record the trip home and I put a few of the highlights of the trip, you know, where there's some of the traffic and the intersection shuffles, they're fun. They're always fun. So enjoy, enjoy. Full charge on the battery is 66.6 .6 volts. And we arrived on 65 volts, and that worked out to be about 15% of the charge used. Ah, we're here in Zapote, and we are going around to have a look at the there's Ray. We're going this way, and Ray's coming that way. Okay, we keep going. A yeah, big apartment block, isn't it? Yeah. Across there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mega expensive too, I bet. Is it apartments? Condominiums. Condominiums. Oh, that's right. You don't call them apartments here. Not when they look like that. You call it condominiums. Yeah. <laughs> ah, the pile of... Gravel and cement is lower. Nice. Putting the form work in. Ah, the roof's gone. Hello. Are they continuing the floor across there? Morning. Are they continuing the floor across there? Ah, later. What's the matter, Doc? <laughs> ah, so they're putting in the formwork. Careful. Getting ready now, Doc, or I know for the boo Yeah, that's going to be the stairs. Yeah. yeah that. <laughs> that hole we can see over in the left. 
corner is the stairs, so a lot of the stairs. Mm -hmm. Bathroom will be in that corner. Where the ventilation hole is on the wall, you can see it. And the window, more window. Looking good. Yeah, it's gonna have to be the over. So you have to leave a one meter easement to the curb, which is there. But the first floor can stick over that one meter, or up to that one meter, level with the curb. As you can see in all the other buildings. Looking good. Can I English din you sell tao? Do you have to speak English? Or you, or you have to translate it? <laughs> it's up to me. Bala ka nga dyan. Agagan na ubus ang English ko sa'yo. It's too early. No, my English is gun. Ah, uh, eh, E O U. This is uh, the second floor of uh, Timur's, this, no, Timur's place. The development of uh, Craig's uh, project. Maybe. Uh, Wednesday, boss? Wednesday now, boss tayo? Maybe on Wednesday we're gonna have some... The concrete. The schedule of concreting of the second floor. That's it. And thank you. <laughs> and the site manager. See the site manager? Yeah. Thanks to the site manager for taking the video upstairs. I don't do letters. My hips worth too much. I should be filming, eh? Hello. Hello. I got sixty three point five. Maybe. And if you have to go to the first place, you have to cross. And then go to the other people, you have to go by the other people. Right. So you have to go right there. Okay. And I have to look to the left and look to the right. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's not so busy now. Keep Turn at the end of the island.
here. Oh, bugger. Very still. Ah, she's back. It's right. Thank you. Oh, oh masarap. Yeah. when the turn is Jolly B.
big car. Well, now. Bit of a bump. Terminal markets, oh yeah.
were going to stop at Jen and Michelle's place. But just up here in a second, we happened upon Merck, Jen and Michelle's eldest son, who was in a restaurant eating. So we delivered the, the package to him that had to be delivered to Jen and Michelle. So that worked out quite well for everybody. You'll see his reflection in the back of this black car in a moment when he came over to the bike. Yeah, man. Okay. Yeah, I just saw somebody. I was looking. Say, oh, there's a restaurant. And someone waving at me. Truck, he's big. Oh, my last. It's a little bit hard to read, and I apologise for that. But you can see that there's 62.1 volts remaining after our return journey, so it's a, roughly about 65% of the battery. Well, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And we'll keep you up to date on the build and support. Eh? Obviously, now that we know the um, little e-bike, it's a breeze. You know. By the time we got home, the battery was on um, what sixty-five uh, percent. So uh, there's no problem at all going to and from Zapote. And now that I've actually driven that way, I've been that way many times. But I'm always a passenger, and I have a bad habit of when I'm a passenger. I don't take much notice of where we're going because I'm looking around at all the you know, looking at all the sights. So that now that I've driven that way, I know it's virtually you go down to the main road, turn left, turn right at Palapara Road, and just keep following. When we get to the highway, turn right. Jollibee. When we get to Jollibee, turn right. Cross the bridge and it's first on the left. It's easy. Yeah, so anyway, hope you all enjoyed this video and 
We shall see you all next time with an update. Uru.